Hello and welcome to Gate Network Question Series. Now we are on question number 11, which was been asked in Gate 1993 in Triple E branch for one mark. The question is based on resonant condition. Resonant condition. What the question says is the following circuit resonates at. What we need to calculate the value of omega that is angular frequency we need to calculate radian per second radian per second so we need to calculate the omega in radian per second under resonant condition so we all know that under resonant condition z is equals to r that is the equivalent impedance of the circuit equals to the resistance itself resistance itself that means imaginary part is equals to zero imaginary part is equals to zero we always write r is z is equals to r plus minus j x that is the imaginary part and it is equals to zero only then z will be equal to r so we need to calculate the imaginary part of impedance imaginary part of impedance z and that we will equal to, equate to zero and then we will know the value of omega then we will know the value of omega so first thing we need to do is convert this value into ohmic value into ohmic value so xl will be equal to j omega l j omega l is 4 that is j 4 omega this is equals to this is equals to j 4 omega j 4 omega x is equals to minus minus of okay let it be 1 upon j omega only 1 upon j omega c that is value of xc and 1 upon j omega we don't know we need to calculate the value of omega and c c is 1 so it is 1 upon j omega only it is 1 upon j omega c is equal to 1 the same will be like here 1 upon j omega now now we need to calculate the equivalent impedance z and equate the imaginary part equal to 0 equal to 0 so z will be equal to 1 plus of 1 plus of j4 omega plus 1 upon j omega into 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 these are in correct connected in parallel this is these are in series and now this one is in parallel so 1 upon j omega 1 upon j omega divide by the sum of all the sum of all that means j4 omega plus of 1 upon j omega plus of 1 upon j omega 1 upon j omega now it is equal to j denominator j numerator will cancel omega nu denomin denominator omega numerator will cancel so it will be equal to 4 plus 1 upon 1 upon j omega square it is minus of minus of 1 upon omega square minus of 1 upon omega square why because j square is equals to minus 1 we all know j square is equals to minus 1 so minus 1 the sign is given right here divide by divide by divide by okay j 4 omega j 4 omega plus 2 upon j omega 2 upon j omega it can be also written as 1 plus 1 plus 4 minus 1 upon omega square 4 plus 1 upon omega square okay j 4 omega minus minus j 2 by omega we can write this 1 upon j is minus of j 1 upon j is minus of j now we can take this j outside 1 plus of 4 minus 1 upon omega square divide by j is common j is common so 4 omega minus 2 by omega now again this denominator can be shifted upwards with negative sign with negative sign with negative sign so what is the imaginary part 
this particular thing is the imaginary part why because it is having the j j is imaginary operator i will drop it from here now we need to equate imaginary part equal to zero why because the resonant condition is given so j j 4 minus 1 upon omega square 4 minus 1 upon omega square divided by 4 omega minus 2 upon omega is equal to zero is equal to zero this will go this side get zero okay and this will again go this side it will be equal to zero so 4 minus 1 upon omega square is equals to zero that means 4 is equals to 1 upon omega square that means that means omega omega is equals to 1 upon under root of 4 that means omega is equals to 1 upon 2 that is equals to 0.5 radian per second so value of omega is 0.5 radian per second so option b is the correct one option b is the correct one so i hope you have got the solution right this is a very important problem asked in gate 1993 only for one mark so i hope you have got this solution thanks for watching stay tuned